So here's a quick little extra video for the weekend. Here are three Mac apps that you can get in the Mac App Store completely free, no nonsense like in-app purchases or subscriptions or anything like that and they're actually useful. First let's look at this text edit alternative called COT Editor or COT Editor. I'm not sure if it's pronounced like that. It's completely free and it's a text editor and I started using it because it's lightning fast and also allows you to work with code in a way that text edit just can't. So here I am in the editor and it's just a basic text editor here. You know, It's got all the different menus where you can change different things about it. You're editing plain text here so you're not really dealing with formatting. But if you have text like maybe this simple HTML here you can set the syntax style to HTML and you can see how it colors the text in. And it has a ton of different programming languages and things that you could use to style the text so that you can more easily edit it. I use it to edit files on the server but I also use it to keep show notes and simple text files for doing my videos throughout the week. Second I've got Cloud Clip Manager. Now I can't live without a clipboard manager. This is an app that basically runs in the background on your Mac and gives you more than one clipboard. Every time you copy something it goes into a list and you can go back two, three, four, ten times to see what you've copied and paste things that you had copied previously. right? So it manages your clipboard. Cloud Clip Manager is one of a few different clipboard managers you can find in the Mac App Store and several others are free as well. I like this one. It just works. You can see it here and you can see the old things I've copied. Let me switch over here back into COT Editor and I can select some text, do Command C, can select some more text, do Command C. I look in Cloud Clip here and I can see the different things that I've copied and it will just go back in time and I can do various things with them, clear them, all of that. And of course as the name suggests it works in the cloud. So anything I copy on my MacBook it's going to appear here on my Mac Pro and vice versa which is really useful too. Here's one that's been around for a long time. I'm glad to see it's still there and updated all the time. It's called Seashore and it's a completely free graphics program. So a lot of people have moved on from using expensive graphics software like Photoshop and there are plenty of things in the Mac App Store like Acorn and Pixelmator that are really good at about 30 bucks or more. Seashore is just free. So here it is and you can see it looks a lot different than a lot of graphics software. As a matter of fact it really excels in pixel editing if you want to get down all the way to the pixel level here and edit things. But you have a large selection of things like you know, filters and adjustments and you can select and add text and do all sorts of things that you might be used to doing in any graphics app. And then when you're done with it you can export in a variety of different formats with different options and everything. So it's a great alternative if you just want a quick graphics app but you don't want to spend any money. So share with me what your favorite free apps are for the Mac. The three rules are it's got to be in the Mac App Store, it's got to be really free, no in-app purchases or subscriptions, and it has to be something that's useful. Leave your suggestions in the comments below. I publish new tutorials every weekday. Hit the subscribe button so you don't miss out. Then hit the little bell icon to get notifications for each new tutorial.